Hello and welcome to Garden of Luma where I provide you with tips for growing edibles in hot climates. Hello everybody, Joe here with Garden of Luma. If you guys are new to this channel, please subscribe to stay updated on the latest videos. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys my jujube tree. This is a Sherwood jujube tree and jujubes do really well here in the Phoenix, Arizona area. If you guys are in a hot climate, a hot dry climate especially, these trees just grow like weeds. So I've done a few videos just showing you guys the progress of my tree and I'm going to show you guys today some of the harvest right now. So it is August right now. It is really hot here in the Phoenix, Arizona area, monsoon season, so a little bit of humidity. 30% humidity for us here seems really humid. But anyways, I'm going to show you guys some of my jujubes, what they're looking like now. I'll taste one for you guys. And jujube trees tend to fruit a couple times a year. So you get a summer crop, which isn't quite as tasty as the later crop. Uh, my second crop usually is around Halloween time. So let's go check it out now. First up, I just want to show you guys the height of this tree right now. And I've been pruning this back every winter to try to keep it smaller, but it just wants to grow very tall. It's probably at least 15 feet right now. So this thing just grows really rapidly, even in full sun here in the desert. All right, so let's get a little closer up here. All right, so you can see some of the fruit here that have dropped to the ground. So this is what they look like as they start to dry up. They turn really brown and the inside of them starts to get mushy. And some people like to eat them this way. And to me, when you eat them like this, when they're shriveled up, they taste similar to like a dried apple, if you guys have ever tried that. Some people compare them to dates, but I don't think they taste quite like dates. More like those dried apples. All right, so going up the tree here. Okay, so you can see a lot of these jujubes here. I've already eaten quite a bit. My kids just love these things. And you want to start picking them as they start turning like a little bit brown like this or even darker brown like half brown half like a cream colored and you want to get them as they're like about a cream colored and they're still pretty good that way here's one up here i'm going to grab this, as you can see, has some brown on it. Looks like the birds have even started to get to it. So I'll eat on the back side of it. So there you go. You can see it's uh, white inside. Pretty crunchy, sweet. At first, your brain thinks it's like an apple because it's got that crunch like an apple, but it's not as juicy. A little bit on the drier side but it's still got a nice sweetness to it, more like a sugar cane sweetness. All right, so these produce quite abundantly, jujubes here. Really easy, really easy tree to grow in hot climates. One of the concerns is the suckers at the base of the tree. I haven't had too much of an issue with that, but I know that's been a concern for some people. I think as long as you keep it watered, it's not as big of a deal. All right, check me out at GardenOfLuma.com for more tips on gardening and growing fruit trees, especially in hot, dry climates. Thanks for watching.